President. In July, I had the pleasure of visiting the Yakandanda Health Facility, a community-owned, not-for-profit organisation nestled in the beautiful Yakandanda Valley in northeast Victoria. Based on the bush nursing model, the site is home to 77 residents with a residential, within the residential aged care facility. The new six million building opened in 2018, which was at the time when I was standing as a candidate for the upcoming election. I made a quiet promise to myself that if elected, I would return to learn more about what this beautiful facility could provide to the people of Yakandanda. The new building offers 16 residential aged care rooms upstairs and 10 one-bedroom apartments for the individuals or couples downstairs. There are opportunities for residents to contribute to gardening and maintenance of the grounds. The men's shed, uh, which is located at the facility, provides furniture for the childcare centre, which has recently opened within the Yakandanda Health. The facility also provides primary health services, such as physiotherapy, home support, bowen therapy, medical centre and midwife service, to name a few. The Yakandanda model and the care sanctuary are currently in the planning stage with a focus on intergenerational living to provide more options and facility community interactions for residents. The care sanctuary was supported by the community and the Victorian government's Pick My Project initiative. I would urge government representatives to travel to Yakandanda to visit this facility and use this model as an, a primary example of how to achieve quality care and livability for our elderly. Ms. Taylor.